What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another episode, you guys. Today, today we're at a little bit of a different spot. I've been down here before. I haven't fished down here in a while, you guys. I just seen that they built something across the river. You can barely see it. I might zoom in, but I mean, I don't know what. It's like a, a brick wall blocking the other side over there. So I had to come over to this. Side. I've been to this side plenty of times. Anyways, you guys, we're about to get up here to my spot that I like to fish, my little rock that I like to get up to. See if we can't get on a fish or two. I'm uh, targeted species today. It's definitely going to be some smallmouth. Uh, and whatever else is going to bite, you know. So, we'll uh, we'll let you guys know. I got one guy right here fishing. He might be getting a bite. Right, I'm about to get up here to my rock, though. I got to get up here to this rock that I like to fish, you guys. This is a... Uh, the awesome rock there's an awesome rock over here that i like to fish off of it's got uh you know a good little pool area to toss into this water is super low super low compared to the last time i was out here you guys so wish me luck um if you guys would please go ahead and smash that thumbs up if you, if you have been enjoying all of this different content different fish different species i'm enjoying it i know that much so uh if you guys are enjoying it Go ahead and smash that thumbs up. Uh, hit that subscribe button if you guys haven't already. And we will see you guys at the spot here in just a second. Peace. Holy cow, my rock is covered in stuff, you guys. Look at that. My rock is covered in all kinds of debris. Usually the rock that I like to get on, this thing is covered in stuff, you guys. I mean, this is usually a good little deep pool right here to cast into. We're gonna see what it's all about if I can get over here without running any kind of snakes or anything like that. It looks like a straight up snake pit of logs. Yeah, it looks like a straight up snake pit of logs, mosquitoes all kinds of bugs look at the water the water looks good though you guys the water looks super clear today super clear i might even walk out that way a little bit to tell you the truth we'll find out here in just a few minutes how i feel about doing that but for now we're just going to try to get here that's all to it. I just want to get to this spot. I want to start fishing. B E A U T U P O. I have caught some smallmouth, some beautiful smallmouth out of this spot, you guys. Beautiful looking smallmouth. Start out with the old buzzard. See if we can't get something to pop the top on this thing. If not, we're going to switch up to the Texas rig. What I know always works good on smallmouth. Just a good old Texas rig with either uh, probably a crawl on there, to be honest with you. Crack and crawl, you guys, my Gigan squad. A little one out hook on there, and uh, I believe I got a, a, a half ounce, quarter ounce weight on there. Got him, you guys. Got him. Got him. <sighs> little guy. Little guy, but I don't care. I don't care. I don't care how small he is. Whew. Yes. 
Look at that, you guys. Perfect. Tiny little guy, but hey, I am not going to complain. You will never really see me complain about how small a fish is, especially when it's that beautiful, you guys. I mean, that is a beautiful looking small mouth. I don't care. Even the smaller ones look better than the big ones, you guys. That is so cool. All right, you guys, look at this beautiful, beautiful little small mouth, you guys. This guy is so beautiful. I love these small mouth colors on them. They're so, they so colorful. Let's go ahead and let this little guy go. Nifty little guy. Oh my God, giant carp right there. That is a giant carp. had a massive cart come up right up to me you guys that was that was weird first one of the day small little tiny little small mouth you guys let's put it back in the same spot see if there's any more down there First one, hopefully not the last one of the day, you guys. I am really hoping not. Hoping for a good smallmouth today. That was definitely the target species that I am after. I am also going after whatever will bite. <laughs> He had it too, he had it good. He's got it again. Oh, damn. Picked it up twice. That feels a little better. That feels a little better, you guys. You about messed me up, little guy. You about messed me up, man. Ooh, God, he did. Ah. Ow. Dang, look at that, you guys. He, he freaking slipped out of my hand. The hook went into my hand and ripped out. Ow, that freaking hurt. Another tiny little guy. Beautiful, beautiful fish, man. Fish number two, you guys. Ten minutes later, fish number two since I started the first recording. Beautiful, beautiful, another little smallmouth. I got a feeling they're stacked down this way, you guys, apparently. So we're going to get back out there. Look, we still see him right there. He's sitting right there, you guys. Yeah. That's what I was looking for the whole time. Good old smallmouth, you guys. That's a good, like, three, two pounder. 
If you were to stop freaking out, I can grab them. Oh my god. Beautiful small mouth. <gasps> god, that makes me happy. God, you guys, look at that. That is a beautiful smallmouth. Beautiful smallmouth. Yes. Ah, about a hundred casts later. <laughs> oh, yes, you guys. Don't you go freaking out on me, little fish. All right. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Beautiful, beautiful smallmouth. Third one for the day. Two little dinkers, and then this guy winds up eating it on the same spot where I've been throwing it the entire time. We're gonna continue going. Thank you guys for watching. Let's let this beautiful fish go. That is a beautiful fish, you guys. Beautiful fish. Another one 